If you haven't seen this geometry problem before, now you have. The goal is simple, find the missing angle. We're gonna solve it now. So you probably know that when two adjacent angles make a straight angle, they add up to 180 degrees. And yes, this applies to three or more angles too. Together, they'll all add up to 180 degrees. Does this mean that adding 110 with 100 and X will give you 180? No. That's because if you look at this blue curve here, it's saying that the 110 degrees refers to this angle. Similarly, this 100 degree angle is this angle. Because there's overlap between these angles, when we add 110 with X with 100, we're gonna get more than 180. But if we had these three adjacent angles here, we could add these together to get 180. The blue angle down here you can find by taking away X from 110. So this is 110 minus X degrees. Similarly, for the red angle, you can take away X from 100. So this is 100 minus X degrees. Now we can add the measures of these three adjacent angles. And when we add them all together, we should expect to see 180. After combining like terms, we get 210 minus X equals 180. Subtract 210 from both sides and get negative X equals negative 30. And so X equals 30. So this angle is 30 degrees. This actually reminds me of another type of problem that's very similar to this. At a restaurant, 36 people ate dinner and 24 people ate dessert. If 54 people ate at the restaurant, how many people ate both dinner and dessert? Dinner and dessert are your only options at this restaurant. Leave a comment if you can solve it.